here we have the BMW 520. It's the first generation of the uh, BMW 5 series. Nice wheels. And right beside we have the predecessor of the 5 series. Loving these uh, old chrome caps. So let's see what it is. It is a BMW 3 liter, but that stands 2.8 liters. And it has different wheel caps. Here are the more flat ones, and these ones are different. But well, still original wheel caps. Look at this guys, very very beautiful. And now let's go again to the BMW 5 series. Very beautiful. And look here. Very nice looking inside. And this here is the first generation of the BMW 3 Series. Took some time until this one was becoming more popular on these meetings. The successor is uh, much more popular. This is really a very beautiful car. So at Classics and Coffee there are cars allowed that are at least 20 years old. So this one is most probably already 20 years old. Left beside is my car. And this year um, this is an Audi RS4. It is based on the B5 platform. It's an event. And there are some looking at my car, I think. No, they have decided to walk again away. So here is my car. The paint, by the way, is called Pasadena Yellow. So this is a yellow color. And just to let you see, I'm close to the 100,000 kilometers on this machine. And I'm thinking it is real. When I have no uh, history of that car to be entirely sure, but I guess so. I've driven that car so far for around 30 to 40,000 kilometers. And it's really reliable. Audi 80 B2 or type 81 because it's a front wheel drive. Here we have a baby Benz again, W201. This one here is a beautiful red W123. I hope last at the last 123 I didn't say 124 because the 124 is this one and uh, this one is the A124 because this is the convertible and as you can tell by the white indicator glass and the different grill so this is the first generation of the so-called E-Class from Mercedes-Benz 
and this one was the pre facelift so well pre facelift from the one uh, left beside because this is not the um, very first facelift um, and not the very first pre facelift so you can see that by the painted bumpers also an A124 this year guys is a tri uh, Triumph TR6 and glad it's opened it's a pretty short stuff and beautiful in my opinion I like these uh, British roadsters. Look at this, guys. Probably not the fastest, but beautiful British stuff. That's a roadster again very popular on these meetings here here we have another baby bands and here we have a uh, person coming up Volkswagen Golf Cabriolet it's a compatible the third generation Opel Cadet B, it's an LS Coupe, very beautiful car. There was also previously another um, coupe of the uh, Cadet B, not at this meeting, but um, it had different um, rear side windows. It was called the, oh, what means Keeman in English, I have no idea. And there's also one flatback version of that one that's also very often um, called to be the coupe. It meant fastback, not flatback. Uh, this here is an CLK, I would say. The second generation. Yes, CLK 280. Also very nice coupe, very beautiful series 126, I absolutely love this one, here's a stroke 8, another SL. BMW 7 Series in a wonderful color. It's a very cool color. BMW 735i Here's the SL again Let's 
stroke eight pre facelift as you can tell by the taillights. Wonderful. And the 126, it's a 560 SEL, super extra long. 